Thank you very much, Dr. Peng. That was a wonderful presentation. Um, because of the time, I think that I'll just ask one question if that's okay, and then hopefully we'll have a little bit more time at the end with the morning panelists uh, to go through other questions. But a uh, couple of the themes that have come up in the chat, uh, Dr. Peng, have been how do patients and the public support uh, creating a dedicated SIH program in Canada? What do you think that uh, patients or the public can do to help support this cause? So th there's a number of um, areas that we can do. One is uh, the increase the awareness and so that uh, um, the, the government will have uh, we'll pay attention to this. So a lot of those resources are driven. So remember, the, the healthcare resources is a fixed part. The government somehow dedicate their resources based on sometimes the noise. So uh, we just learn the trick, so we just make the noise. Um, then the, the second is that we need to just uh, um, uh, bring this awareness among our medical profession. And uh, just somehow not a lot of people uh, in our profession are interested in this. So I, I think we bring more resources. And finally, I, I think the most important is um, a lot of those activities uh, are driven by the Ministry of Health, how they uh, have a, pay attention to this. They, in Ministry of Health, there's nothing uh, in particular uh, 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 in terms of the schedule. I talk about the, the intracranial hypotension. And that's the reason why no, no difficult to get any healthcare profession to be interested in this. So this is the first stream that we are trying to um, get a more, more support in the Ministry of Health so that uh, we can just uh, in all this front. But finally, I think the most important is a coordinated program. We never have a coordinated program. Um, we are working in silos. So everyone are good, but then they would just disjoint. So when I have a problem, I beg the other physician to do it. Uh, but if it's a program, we can just automatically just coordinate. Uh, everyone will chip in and coordinate the care.